Hi everyone, this is Ed from Bispoke Airsoft. In this video, I'm going to show you two holster and some new guns. So um, I will not do a lot of editing, just straightforward to show you how many guns it can fit on this XDM holster and um, some new cyber gun, limited version, uh, poker version, that's an ego and other that's an ego will fit on this holster. Okay, let's get started. Let's put this away. So this is the that's an ego holster. Uh, it's got the official license, so it's got a engraved logo here. You can feel it, and um, it's a belt fit. So press and open, and then you can adjust this thing here in order to have a wider belt or a smaller belt, one and a half inch, two inch, whatever more uh, larger tactical belt and uh, if you want to fit it on your on your neck then you can undo the screw and find the appropriate dimension it looks like a star throw land to me yeah it's got extra hole here the triangle shape interlocking system so I assume you can also put it on your on your fine so Let's do it. Um, this is the WE, also got this uh, license from Cybergun, that's the Ego. This is the older shape, uh, the original, that's the Ego, with the silver tiger strike. And then this is the newer XIX L6 with the bottom and top rail. You can also fit on it. So the gun is pretty heavy, so I don't think um, this gun will come out when you run. I'm not sure if you have a jump. It's not that tight, but I think you can adjust by the tightening the two screw here. The trigger guard should be tighter before you draw. And let's check out the new guns that just released. It's a limited 300 pieces. It's got the the name here, that's Ego 50 AE Poker Limited Edition. So let's see what it's got. It's, uh, it's a CO2 operated and uh, 21 round in the magazine. Um, the good thing is uh, it's a semi and full auto. So this gun can be fired in full auto. So um, the weight, this is no magazine. So it's similar, this one has magazine. The reason why the weight is similar because the low frame is in plastic, just be aware of that. And the slide and barrel is metal, so the top half is metal, the lower half is wood and plastic. And on each gun, it's got an individual number. This one is 130 or 300 limited. And uh, one of the feature is this poker grip. Is that the king killer? Let me try to focus. Yep. Very nice grip. Focus. So as you can see, the trendy is mean full auto, one is semi auto, and then that's the safe. So this is um, on full auto right now but this gun is uh, limited so I'm not going to test fire it um, I remember this gun is similar to the one that KWC has so I think it's the KWC full auto system and the holster yeah so uh, I think the grid is uh, using laser laser machine so it can smell the burn when you bring closer to your nose so if you want to grab one of these be quick it's unlimited we only have uh, 10 of these in stock if it's sold out it's sold out the other thing that come in the package is those poker cards 
I saw the gun and there's a uh, for the glass glass pad the uh, key for the CO2 magazine and then there's one extra bit is the cyber gun chip and come with the hard case just like that okay I can dry fire to let you hear the noise so this is the lasso So moving on to this Springfield Armor hard polymer holster for XDM only. Um, it said for XDM, but I've tried the other model. It can still fit fit it well. So first of all, I'm trying the uh, WE also got the Springfield license XDM. Of course, it fits. So when it fits, that's this kind of noise that it produces when you run running around. So. We we'll compare the same noise as the other model. So this is the compact version of the XDM. Pretty nice gun. Got the all the marking. And um, you can also use the standard magazine. So this is the uh, compact magazine. So what it looks like. And also come with different size. Sorry, different size of uh, back strap for different hand size. Remove that and install that. And this is the um, for the standard size magazine to put it in here in order to fill, to fill up the empty fingers gap. So Springfield USA licensed menu. So let's try the other platform. So the SRG M17, uh, this is the grey one. We've got it installed, the CO2 version, CO2 magazine version. So the M14, sorry, the M17 fit perfectly, even tighter than the XDM. So that's why we have written on the website that uh, the M17 and M18, the compact version, we also fit. Um, this is my own gun, just uh, in case I'm shooting this and I thought maybe it's good to show off my babies. This is the uh, stainless steel uh, pro cut version and I've also changed the lower frame with the harder recoil spring. It's one of my favorite recently. Not recently, maybe two years ago, one one or two years ago. Anyway, continue the test. We have the Cybergun FNS9. So um, what I usually do is when you observe the trigger guard shape, that's how it locked. So whatever the shape is similar, we we'll try. So let's see the FNS9. So it can lock, but it, it's too noisy and it's like um, too loose so I wouldn't say this is um, this fit but if you can't find a holster that's maybe your last option use the XDM and then we've got the WE funny one GP1799 it's the mixture of Glock P99 so again it's a little bit noisy but it's locked and then one last one the MMP9 can also lock. That's the noise it produces when you run. So thank you for watching this uh, short video. So if you like it, just uh, leave some comments, like and subscribe. Thank you very much.